Hello my friends, have you ever wanted to start a video game but didn't know how to do it? Well Kyle Deere did it in a span of about six months to a year and he didn't know anything. Hello and welcome, this channel is all about helping you find a path to a career in interactive entertainment, in other words, helping you become a player in the game. Kyle, lead designer, owner, Dunamite Studios. Yep. has created his own game from scratch, autocross, realistic autocross. Super it, realistic autocross. Super realistic autocross, and it is looking real cool. Tell us all about your game. We've already done an episode about how to get started when he started from scratch, learned on Unity and used Blender, all free assets that you can learn how to make a game on. Link up there to that video or in the description below. But now he's gonna tell you a little bit about the game, so if you're interested in it, you can go check it out. And where can they go check it out? They can check it out on Steam for $10. Steam for 10 bucks, and it's a great value at 10 bucks. Tell us about the game. So Super Realistic Autocross is a game that teaches you how to race real autocross. I raced it in real life, and basically we wanted to bring it to more people, kind of spread the word on the sport so they could get interested in it. Basically, autocross is you set up a track anywhere, an airport tarmac, parking lot, and you just set it up with cones. You're basically racing through gates of cones as fast as you can for time. They give you classes based on your car, so you can be competitive even if you have a slow car versus a supercar. So really you're just racing against yourself. The courses change every time, so the main skill of the sport is learning how to race the course quickly because you only get a limited amount of runs in it. So the game gives you the advantage of having infinite runs so you can learn how to tweak your techniques. And then all of those skills also transition into the real sport as well. We have many autocrossers that we race with that play the game as well and they say, we experience the same emotions in the game as we do in the race. Anytime they hit cones, they get mad, they're like, yep, that's what we see in the real game. So it's great to give them a little bit extra seat time and exposure to the sport. Everyone's been learning a lot from it. Awesome, that's amazing. Be sure to check it out if you're interested in that, and I think you should be because it does have not as much exposure as it should. Again, <laughs> he started from scratch and got it built within the span of six months to a year using yep. free tools that you can use to build yep. your own game. So check it out, see if he can do it, and I can do it, and you can do it. Anybody can do it, you can do it. All right, my friends, if you're interested in this concept and you'd like to find more information about it, then by all means, please be sure to subscribe by clicking on the link below. Do Until it. next time, do it. Thank you, Kyle. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me, man. Thank I you. hope things go well for you. I can't wait to get over there and demo it again. Yep. Uh, until next time, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again real soon.